came up to me and told me that this might be her last night on earth. Woo! <laughs> and then she went to me, I got the cancer. Start! <laughs> you know, I just, he said, Boss, I got the cancer. <laughs> Boss, please. <laughs> you better shut your mouth, man. I will hear none of that. Splashing around. Oh, it's good to fucking see you, mate. Fucking good to fucking see you, cunt. How the fuck are you been? Fucking Roger's been grinding me fucking balls up into a fucking pile of fucking mashed just potato. Oh, how fucking dare you touch me? Oh, I'll fuck you up, mate. I'm trained in the martial arts of drunken beer and cunts with goody goo. I'll fucking do it, mate. I'm not. Oh, shut the fuck up, mate. I'm fucking sick of your shit, mate. Oh, fuck me in the asshole with a strudel spoon. Yeah. Good to see you guys today. Oh, we're here to do our most favourite of reactions today. We're doing this new segment where we listen to a lot of other countries, and today we've chosen fucking Argentina, because you cunts are fucking fabulous. <sighs> Me name is uh, Cockadoodle Stew. Woo, and I'm going to say my real name because um, i got a lot of beautiful Spanish women following me, and I'm very superficial, and um, I like people and communicate with people. So my name is Alexander Sandalas. Talk about that. That is my real name. Well, fuck, if they look you up, will they find you or will they find a fucking cockastrum dude? <laughs> They'll find me, man. Yeah, okay, good. They'll find me. A picture of you, huh? Yeah, man. 10,000 naked pictures of me laying with roosters. Thousands of them. <laughs> anyway, give us some knowledge on this artist. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, this is, um, so one of the uh, Spanish uh, girls who, from our other Rosalia reaction review, she messaged me and she said she got some Argentinian rapper that she thought she might like. Ooh. So Joe recommended Paulo Lontra. Yeah, thank you Joe, shout out. Um, and we're going to review Chica Paranormal with Ooh. the music video. Ooh. I know nothing about this, um, but yeah, Joe recommended him, so shout out to Joe. Yeah, if it's whack Joe, I'm going to shit in your toaster. <laughs> but if it's good, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cook you toast. Because that's all I know really how to cook. Bro. That's a lie, actually. I've been learning to cook better. Yeah, I'm getting tell better. Him, tell him, bro. I've been cooking up some, some passes, some rice dishes, a lot of veggies, a lot of spices, everything nice. a song to his Spotify, that's when you know he likes it. Well, that's fucking obvious. That's when you know it's a great song. Paulo Londra. Look, oh. <coughs> from the Argentina, isn't he? Yeah, Argentina. From the beginning of the track, when he kind of began the instrumental with the uh, slightly altered it just sound toy. Like, it just sounds like a music box. Right, music mm. box toy. And then he built on that and mm. hit a heavy... Beautiful hypnotizing production. Yeah, great trap beat that came in there. Mm. Dun, 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 dun. I fuck with that, man. It was, it was weird because obviously you've been watching me. So you've watched me go from the beginning to sort of just sitting here and just being like, what is this dude doing? To, to, the, to the middle of the track being like, okay. And then towards the end, I was just hooked. I was just, I, I was just captured and I, I was just fucking absorbed into this track. He's got such 
a melodic and beautiful voice which he uses beautifully with his... He's with, got um, a beautiful voice that he uses beautifully? Well, well more the language. Is it Spanish? Yes. The first thing that comes... I type in what language do, do Argentinians speak. The first thing that comes up is which language should Australian children be learning? <laughs> Tell me how that's helping. Okay, I wrote... Okay, sorry guys. I put the wrong thing in. I said oh, obviously. Two, I put what languages two Argentinians speak. <laughs> Um, so anyway, Spanish. Yeah, I thought it was Spanish. Spanish, so, um... We can cut all this out so we don't look like fucking idiots. Bro, uh, that intro gives us... That's, that's... <laughs> I think that's enough. Um, but yeah, like, I just love the the Spanish language, man. It's such a beautiful, sexy language. 100%. And, um, oh, there you go. The, the way he... His deli- you can see he wears his inspiration. You can see his, his inspirations come from from mm. his delivery to his cadence to his uh, fast flow, taking it back. You know, he he obviously listens. It sounds like he listens to a lot of American rap. Oh yeah, for sure. And that's not bad because he delivered it in a way that was very pleasing. Yeah, and to have twenty three million views from a video that would have cost you five dollars to make. <laughs> I don't know that You're doing that good. that woman doesn't seem cheap. That girl doesn't seem cheap. You know, she she might be some supermodel. She might be his friend. Maybe she didn't cost anything. How dare you assume that they're gonna pay money to get a girl on their video? Hell yeah, rappers hire <laughs> models all the fucking time. What track was it called again? Okay, so it's called Chica Paranormal. And oh. pa- so it means paranormal girl, which is what obviously what the girl in the video oh. probably represented. Sorry, I got the English translation here, guys. I'm rap genius. Let me give it to you. Let's do it. I've got th- I've got thousand problems tormenting me and they don't leave me quiet alone. Every time I get a little more crazy and this is about to consume me. Mm-hmm. Chorus. But when she calls me, we forget everything they're in bed. We don't even even want to look back in time, just freeze our moment. Mm. But when she calls me, brrr, we forget everything there in bed. Yeah, we don't ever want to look back in time. Nah, just freeze our moment. That's just the hook again. Verse. Let's forget everything, baby, without thinking, <laughs> without thinking about anyone else. Every time she calls, look, he has something that makes me forget everything that bothers me. <laughs> a paranormal girl. <laughs> Woo! I can't leave her. Yeah. She has something that leads me to see it every time. And I know well how you err, but I do not understand your powers to make me fall into limbo inside those four walls. I feel that life and stress come together to torment me. A. Hey, and I follow my steps when Sorry, I fall. out of place. <laughs> Yo, to torment me. Hey! Well, well, man, that's what he's saying. Is he, though? We don't know if this translator is correct. Man, this translation is by one contributor. It's got to be correct. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it's interesting. So he's obviously um, depicting his uh, relation, uh, how he's experiencing this relationship and this... Um, how do I say? Ass me. Shake that ass me. Oh, yeah. Shake that ass me. Yeah, anyway, what were you going to say? Yeah, why, why the fuck not? We can cut out whatever the fuck we want. If I could see you, I would tell you to be mine again. Cold night in your company would take me out of fear. That generates me all these annoying complications. Woo! They just want to see the <laughs> night. <laughs> can you please just leave those out? It's fucking killing me. Just leave all the fucking words. It's what it says. I know. Bro. Just, just leave them out. I can't focus on the lyrics when you do it that bad. It's like, yo, and then and then, <laughs> she, and then she came up to me and told me that this might be her last night on earth. Woo! <laughs> and then she went to me. I got the cancer. <laughs> you know, I just, he said, boss, I got the cancer. <laughs> boss, please. <laughs> Hey, boss! I got the cancer, please, boss! I got the cancer! Yeah, I did it much better. Yeah, you did. I'm sorry, I just want to... You could have done something you. different, like like any... any. Can I have a pizza, please? <laughs> yeah. Hey, boss! Hey, boss! <clears throat> yeah, man, we you should... have me cornered. I'm at your will. Let's stop thinking on it and let's get out of here. We should react to Joji, bro. That it only hurts us. Well, it's good to see you listening <laughs> when I fucking did it normally. <laughs> Lou, it just sounds like he wants to run away with this girl and um, this girl is kind of why has she... him enveloped in his emotions. But why is she paranormal? Is she alive? Is it, is it a part of his imagination? Is he saying that he's so high on drugs that everything is just like, everything's like barely real to him and he's just flowing with it? Well, there's no reference to drugs. But I wonder why she's paranormal. Maybe because of the effect she's having on him. Oh, so maybe... Th- She's like, 
so she makes him feel like that she's some sort of like thing that's like taking over his soul. Right, taking yeah, taking over his body and oh, emotions. Oh, I see. That's what that's why he talks about not leaving the bedroom because it's just like she's taking over him in a way. Ooh, that's a really cool concept. If that's what it is, I fuck with that. Yeah, let us know, guys, because um we're pretty stupid people. Um, I'll speak for myself because. <laughs> yeah, man. Have you ever had a girl? take over you like that i've definitely had I had women that like well, i fucked a ghost once and that was pretty crazy <laughs> fuck out of here that shit no legit legitimately I've, I've fucked women that just like at the end of it you, you legit feel like they're possessing you because of how of how connected you are to them right i don't feel like they're possessing me i feel like we're more connected as one being that's kind of what i more resonate with Man, you ain't had crazy sex then yet well all right. <laughs> Slide in the DMs and uh, I'll, I'll be taking requests and I'll be taking inquiries. If so. you're paranormal, if you're into ghosts, if you're a poltergeist, fuck this man up. I think, I think we've covered <laughs> um, um, But yeah, make sure to leave in the comments below. Why you hated this review <laughs> and leave your angry comment of why we're pieces of shit <laughs> in Spanish. And also, please all comment exactly what this song's about. <laughs> hey guys, guys, is this song about a toxic relationship? <laughs> no, 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 but seriously, if we got something wrong, I want you to comment it down below. Oh. And, if you, and if you watch this video, don't check the comments and comment the exact same thing as other people. Please, I love it. please just scroll down a little <laughs> bit. Just a little bit. Just fucking one flick. Just give me oh, one flick. Oh, man. This is our new segment. We're killing it. We're killing the game. We jungle oh. beats. We're the worst reviewers in the country. <laughs> um, make sure to unsubscribe so you stay tuned to all our shit content. <laughs> 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 Ha 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 Mama, they question my starting lineup. You only find a diamond from digging like coal miners. Don't listen to them, designer. The same rappers talking next year will be Uber drivers. Chanel dad hats, but you don't know that they got them.